Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tsai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to disable in-place archiving on Microsoft 365 Outlook webmail. And this is going to apply for the entire account, so it's going to apply for your local Outlook software as well. So by default, you'll have in-place archiving enabled on Microsoft 365 email accounts. And this is even with the business email as well. So what will happen is that any email that is more than two years old will be moved into what's called an in-place archive. And this is a folder which is going to be in a sidebar when you look at your email on the Outlook web access. So that's an online only feature. You won't be able to look at this on your local Outlook. So this is a good idea to have enabled by default if you have a large quantity of email and lots of different users. However, if you want to disable it because you'll say a very small business or you just have a single email account. So all you have to do is to visit the Exchange Admin Center. So I'm gonna leave a link to this in the description. All you have to do is log into your Microsoft Administrator account and you'll be able to access these settings. So on the left sidebar of the Admin Exchange Center, we're gonna to go to Recipients down here and we're gonna to go to Mailboxes. And basically we want to select our user. So I'm gonna select this user here. Then we're going to go to this more action section and we're going to click on manage mailbox archive. So here, this is the in-place archive settings. So this is the new version of the settings menu for this. All we have to do is disable mailbox archive and click save. And then this is going to remove the in-place archive. So now I'm going to press save. If I click yes to here, then what will happen is that the archive will be deleted after 30 days. So if you want to be able to retain your archive, then it's a good idea to move everything inside that folder to a different folder in your Outlook. So here, once I press yes, all of the in-place archive will be deleted and then future emails won't be archived. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.